when uh, boys are joining gp rating course uh, they are uh, with a dream in their mind that what they missed by not, not achieving 10 plus 2 pcm more than 60% marks or to join as deck cadet many of them have missed that chance and then they keep on thinking that i will join as seamen and thereafter i will uh, give the exams and go you know higher on the ranks and finally i will become captain so that is the dream which is there for all the uh, gp rating boys except maybe few of them they may not be having that dream but many of them they have so there are many questions in their mind how to go about it what is the uh, road map for appearing for second mates mates masters and what all things are required to be done how much sea time is required so we are going to discuss that and this video is on demand of many of the gp boys who are telling me please guide us on this sir so i am making for you guys this video so please uh, take full advantage of this information and shape your career that's why i have given the uh, heading for this is shaping your career gp rating to deck officers in this video what all information you are going to get can i appear really for officers exam is it true i have not done 12th pcm am i eligible i have not passed 12th science i have gone up to that but i did not i have done 12th maybe commerce or arts what are the steps will i get job after passing what is nwko ncv and fg will my company give me job after getting second mates and what is advantage of doing this gp course which i have done so all these answers you will get now in this video so it is true boys that all of you who have done gp rating who are working in deck department as seamen you can appear for second mates and clear second mates foreign going but how you will have to do it let us see here this information i got from teep t e a p okay so officer in charge of navigational watch on ships between 500 to 6000 grt operating near coastal voyages so all the ratings who have joined as trainee seamen they will have to appear for this exam first and what is this exam is for near coastal voyages nwko so navigational watch keeping officer ncv near coastal voyages so let us see here what this table says 12th standard 10 plus 2 pcm and minimum 50 percent marks in english okay then 18 years and above and as per pc standards those are medical medical standards are as per pc then all these your five pc courses that is basic safety courses pst fpff efa psr and sts tsd so during gp you have finished this and approved six months pc deck cadet or gp training course so that also you have done okay and if you have done all these things okay if you have done 12th also 12th pcm and then you will require minimum 36 months approved from foreign going sea service okay so 36 months sea time is required on a trading ship more than 500 grt okay and other deck ratings who have done matriculation they have not done 10 plus 2 or something they have done only 10th minimum 50 percent marks in english 18 years pre-c standards and they will have to they have done six months deck course and they have done 
all this basic safety courses also okay so minimum 36 months approved c service if approved 6 months pre c course is not done then those trainee seamen will have to do additional 6 months from the time they get or they will have to put on 36 months after they get watch keeping okay so watch keeping that is uh, r n w once you get then you require to do 36 months but all the boys who have done gp rating course and pass successfully they can start counting their sea time right from the first ship first ship joining and then 36 months sea time then you can appear for this exam that is n w k o n c v and boys who have not uh done pre c course means they have joined just after doing their stcw courses those boys will have to do after they get rnw 36 months okay so normal courses gp rating boys who have done gp rating they will have to do 36 months total sea time starting from the first ship so let us see what are the steps is assessment of RTRB this is rating training record book RTRB is then NWKO NCV course this is navigational watch keeping officer near coastal voyages course that you will have to attend and then you will have to do ROSC ARPA ECDS course GMDSS GOC PSC RB AFF and MFA so these courses also you will have to do these are only uh, courses you will have to attend and give do that e learning assessment uh, assessment test then you will have to attend the course and pass the exit exam so see how many courses are 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 so seven courses you will have to do and nwko ncv course also you will have to attend then you can appear for written and oral examination for nwko ncv okay and then you get certificate of competency officer in charge of navigational watch navigational watch keeping officer on ships between 500 and 6000 grt operating ncv so for coastal voyages ncv you get this certificate to start with your career so what we have discussed just now that if you have done gp rating course then you will have to appear for nwko ncv after 36 months of sea service starting from your first ship and by doing those uh, additional courses so that courses you will have to do and then appear for written and orals of nwko ncv and obtain nwko ncv okay now let us see once you obtain nwko ncv then how you change it to foreign going certificate so this is section 2 oblique 17 in tip okay uh, tip manual which is published in 2014 by dg shipping okay so conversion of grade of certification from ncv to fg lower to higher tonnage okay so from officer in charge of navigational watch on ships from 500 to 6000 grt engage on near coastal voyages okay and 10 plus 2 pcm to officer in charge of navigational watch second mate foreign going okay so what are steps involved here let us see approved sea going service of not less than 18 months as officer in charge of navigational watch nwko ncv so 18 months of sea time is required as nwko ncv on 
मोर देन 500 हंड्रेड जी आर टी शिप्स ओके देन पोस्ट एजुकेशन एंड ट्रेनिंग एज प्रिस्क्राइब इन टू ऑब्लिक वन विच इज गिवन नेक्स्ट ओके एंड प्रोवाइडेड दैट सेकेंड मेट फाउंडेशन कोर्स ऑफ टू मंथ्स वुड बी एग्जेड इफ द स्टूडेंट हैज कंप्लीटेड द अप्रूव्ड प्री सी ट्रेनिंग कोर्स एज डेक कैडेट सो फॉर डेक कैडेट्स इज पी सी एम ई कोर्स इट मे बी एग्जेड ओके देन एग्जामिनेशन एंड असेसमेंट एज गिवन इन सेक्शन टू वन फ्लो चार्ट of conversion from nwko in nwko ncv to your foreign going second mate is given next here this is a flow chart for officers uh, nwko ncv to convert their certificate to second mate foreign going so they will require 18 months nwko ncv Uh, see time then assessment of sea going service foundation course pcme 2 months plus examination and this foundation course is exempted for candidates having done an approved pre c course for deck cadets okay and second mates fc competency course for 4 months so uh, boys who are coming from uh, seamen side they will have to do this pcme two months course as well as four months preparatory course for second mate foreign going okay then they will have to appear for written and oral exam and then they will get officer in charge of navigational watch second mate foreign going uh, certificate on ships 500 tonnage and more so officer in charge nw that is navigational watch okay so this is how you will be completing your second mates and then you join with the mainstream to appear for first mate foreign going master foreign going then the route is same but here you can join like this this table shows you this pcme two months course you can do ratings can do after having ser service of 18 months so once you have c time 18 months you can complete this course whenever it is convenient to you so that uh, facility they have given that earlier also you can complete this course and pass the exam of this pcme okay then nwko ncv competency course 4 months and this is second mates fg competency course that is also 4 months so this you can complete after 18 months this can be done after 30 months sea time total sea time required 36 months but they have given this option to you after 18 months also you can complete this uh, pcme course after 30 months you can complete this nwko ncv course and of course this is after your uh, 18 months of sea service as nwko ncv so this is how your career will progress so so it appears to me that all the boys whether you are from science stream commerce stream arts stream you can do nwko ncv and uh, clear that uh, certificate do 18 months as officer and then you do second mates foreign going okay now question comes where to do it but if you do it in india it is little difficult time consuming and uh, but value is little more you can get job job uh, more easily than if you do it in uk uk exam will be little simple to give this exam and this double in nwko ncv uh, then nwko second met foreign going see to these two things are, are not there in uk It, with one second mates exam you will be able to clear through so but then chances of getting a, a job a little bit difficult so like this your career will uh, progress and you can develop your career so thank you so much all the best boys and any questions you can write email to me and uh, 
कैप्टन जोक्स आई थिंक ऑफ यर बाय बाय